Who would have guessed like 18, 19 years yeah, later, here I am. Jacka has always been a dream and I really want to live that dream. And you know what, really? Okay, my name is Iso. You went to the pool, you like? Hello. You feel, you feel cute. Klein and I, um, so she never says, mensen wat met jou praat op die foe. En dan, uh, we release them. En dan, we create a completely different impression van wie die persoon is met wie hulle praat. En dan loop hulle, en wat ons om met mekeer is? Ja, dit was, wat, 2019 gewees? I think, om 20 juli, augustus, hier en al, ja, is om 3 naad uit gewees van die jaar. En dan praat jy nog beter Afrikaans as ek ook. Natuurlijk doen ek. So jy wil seker weet hoe dit vir die Afrikaans uitgekom. So, ja. ek het in Afrikaanse huis groot geword. My ouwers het vir die mense gewerk, of vir die roots familie. En ek moes vir Carissa leer Soetu praat in Shangaan, en toe eindig ek op die Afrikaans. So kan jy Soetu praat? Ja, ek kan Soetu praat, ek kan Shangaan praat, ek kan Rogonelik he. Ah, ek het he. <laughs> jy klink nie Soetu nie, maar jy probeer te minste. Ja, moet ek jy moet ook al waak so. Ok, hmm. nee, ok, ek gaan niks meer sê nie. Ek dink, jy, okay, jy doen het goed, kan jy Shangaan praat? Nee, ek maak het gehoor, dat is die ding in Shangaan, hulle, hulle, die, die Soetus en die Zulus sal mekaar, um, um, hoe sê mens, as jy, as jy sal mekaar taag, en sê, ah, Shangaan. Ja, om Zulu en, hmm. om Shangaan. Hmm. Ok, so hoeveel talen praat jy, actually? Ok, Engels, Afrikaans, Shangaan, Soetu, a bykie wende, a bykie Zulu, so sê something. En dan praat jy ook vlot jy gerande. Natuurlijk. Wat verwacht jy? <laughs> Wat verwacht jy? So, oké. Okay. En um, jy het vir my kuriers gewerk? Ja, ek het vir 10 jaar vir my kuriers gewerk. Ek was uh, sales um, executive gewees en, vir 7 jaar. En toe word ek een bestuurder vir 3 jaar. En toe krijg jy geleentheid by Jacka, jy weet, of vir een omroeper. En ek het toe maar aanvaar, en hier is ek, twee jaar later, is ek nog steeds met Jacker en Davey, maar ek gaan nie dit baie. Is dit al twee jaar? Dit is amper twee jaar. Ja. Kan ek even, dit, dit maak jy sin in my brein, ne? Nie vir my nie, vir as ek op en af, dit is in Polokwan en sy nie moet rui, gister is het van, letterlik, is een jaar en een half, wat ek in die pad rui, en ek voel het nou eers. Dit is weer. Dit is weer. weer. Um, hoe, hoe, hoe het gebeur? Like, hoe het jy van, um, selling, Expensive premium, cars, premium brands, oh, premium brands, oh, like premium brands. Gem, German cars. Ja, yeah. oké, okay. <laughs> hoe het, hoe het gebeur dat jy vandaaf gaan um, om met ons te praat in ons premium brand car, wat ons heel waarschijnlijk by jou gekoop het, elke middag? Is het elke middag? Of het is elke maandag, woensdag en vrijdag tussen 12 en 4. Ja, so hoe het gebeur? So, Jack Arinder FM met de presenter search dan gedoen, laat 2000 2022, sien jou ver is as al nou, 2024, en ek het allemaal vir my gesê, my na nie, ek dink jy moet gaan auditie, 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 ek sluit, ok, jy, ek gaan dit doen, ek gaan dit doen, want allemaal letterlijk, elke liewe dag, dat ek boodskap gekryk, het toe veel mense nie, dink jy vir my sal, weet jy wat, ek is reeds in radio, want ek het vir Energy FM gewerk, ek het ook vir jou radio gewerk, maar daar was type van, jy weet, jou community radio stations, en toe het ek gedink, ok, cool, let me do it. Ek het letterlik die laaste dag van die Odisse, hulle het oor twee naweke gedoen, toe gaan ek die tweede naweek. Kan ek jy gaan stop? Ja. Dit surprise my glad nie om te hoor, dat jy die laaste dag, die heel laaste Op die audition, <laughs> ja, want toe kom, ek en nou, wees het jou, kan jy mys my wel met foto's, want ek, ek skryf in vir my vrou Suid-Afrika, Ja, maar nou nie, geen probleem, nou ek sal vir jou doen. Hoeveel dagen later? Um, Twee dagen. Ja, wanneer het jy het nodig? Oh, soos my. Vanavond. Wat? <laughs> ek het vanavond nodig. Ja, ja, jy het vanavond, ja, ja, jy het daai aand nodig gehad. En ek is like, ja, maar nie, waar nie, kom, ons is dit, oké. Okay. No, no pressure. I think for me, om eerlijk waar te wees, ek werk lekker onder druk. I love pressure. Sonder druk is ek nie my naam nie nie. Druk is ek. My naam, my tweede naam is druk. So you have to push me and put me in a corner and make me work and I will do the things that I have to do. So druk me na jou ook as jy kan. <laughs> Dis waar ek die beste, beste perform. En ja, ek het het gedoen, ek het die audisie gedoen, ek sê nog of ek speel. Ek sê, 
I think I'm here to do the audition. And I said to my mate, do you think or you want to do it? I'm like, no, I mean, let's give it a try. I don't know. You never know. I could be the next presenter here. And so I said, okay, cool, let's do it. I did it. I a video. I can't even have a video. I can't even have a video. I can't even have a video. I said, girl, are you okay? But my stay with the best way to go. Yeah. So you've got a voice for radio and a I face do. for the studio. I do. Thank mm-hmm. you. And the body so, for the beach. <laughs> And then, okay, so you are now currently Mrs. Limpopo. Yes, I am. What's the biggest difference between, for those people who don't know, like me, because, I mean, I just get a phone call from my nanny every night, I need new photos. Okay, so what's the difference between Miss Limpopo and Mrs. Limpopo? So Mrs. Limpopo is for the married or anyone above the age of 29. And the Miss is anyone from your six-year-old to 18 years old. Okay, and then... Tell us about the progression. So you then send in your photos. I did, yes. Okay, and then after that, what happens? So you send in your pictures, and then obviously after that, they have to go through all the pictures and all the people they receive. And I'm telling you all this with my court lies and to see, okay, we is, we can let mark, we can't mark me. I get the honor out hard, and I must. Entry fee race, so that leer jou basically van bezigheid ook. Mm-hmm. En ja, en toes ek in die finals, en ek kon nie wacht vir die 30ste, no, 25 november laas jaar, op my anniversary nie. En ja, dit was nog my anniversary, mm-hmm. so ek het my anniversary op die stage gevier, met nerves en alles, hakke, voete, wat seer is, allemaal dink, it's, it's like, it's beautiful, it's nice, maar hy anders jy gaan le, en as jou voete so seer, want jy is heel dag in heels, en so aan, maar ja, toe ek gekroon was, I didn't expect it. I could think, I feel like a competition. Um, more, you know, you always have to be prepared. It's okay. Even if I don't make it, this always makes So the thing for me, though, is, um, and and having um, dealt with the industry, the fashion industry for a very long time, it's there's a thousand pretty faces. True. But the problem is, there's only one Manani who can talk. Yeah. Praat te veel, nee. My yeah. kat ons my gesê, ek is radio wat, sonder grens. <laughs> Want ek kon nie ophou praat nie. So, so yeah. um, your husband, what does he do other than sleep with a celebrity? Whew, that's a bit raw, Joe. <laughs> wat sê jy daarvan? Nou is a bietkie rau. Ok, hy is, a, hy is a besteeder by een van die drankwinkels hier in die dorp. En hy is a pastoor ook. Ons het a kerk in Polokwane. And yeah, he's just been an amazing supporter in my life. We've been together for eight years, married for seven years. And I'm hoping and believing that, you know, we'll still carry the candle through for another 80 years because our parents are still married. My father who raised me and my mom, they were married for 52 years before my father died. So, wow. Well, um, I've had the fortune of meeting your husband and your son, who's best friends with my daughter. Uh, mm. Yeah, best friends. Let's yeah. live with it. Because yeah. <laughs> I always tease him like, oh, and your girlfriend is like, no, mommy, she's just my best friend. And, so, <laughs> <laughs> and, and your husband's pretty cool, man. I remember he was just so chilled, like on his phone there in the oh. studio. Um, so speaking of studios, you go through to Polokwane three times a week. Yes, I do. Monday, haven't you Wednesday. thought about like maybe moving to Polokwane? Well, I love Zanine. I feel like I've stayed in Polokwane for more than four years. It's nothing compared to Zani. Definitely, like, you cannot compare the two. Polokwane is the feel. It's your rock move. A dag for me is the feel. So what do you do? When you get to the studio, do you, like... Because you don't just... You don't read the news. I mean, that's... You're not just no. a news reader. You... Because you and Barney and them have, like, discussions. And so what... What, what, what is your job? Do you, must you run around and speak to journalists, like your favorite journalist? No, not really. I don't speak to journalists. So what I do is either the day before that I prepare for the show, whatever's happening around Limpopo, whatever's happening around the world, when I get to the studio, I need to make sure that everything is on, my desk is on, computers are on, and just wait for the show 12 o'clock. So I always have to have content. And that is the beautiful part about it is that you can never run dry or run out of things to talk about. Have you ever met Barney and them? Yes, I have. So, because you guys, you sit here, they sit in Joburg, and then it's like, so, if I understand correctly, right, only the people in Limpopo can hear Manani, except last week when no one could hear you. Well, like, yeah, no, we had a, we had a bit of a, a bug. Yeah, no, Netflix. Okay, so, 
Is that how it works, right? So only we can hear you. The other people in the country can't hear you. No, they can. So Barney's in Midrand, such mm. as in Nelspreit, and mm. I'm in Limpopo. Mm. So you, everyone in the low felt, Limpopo and in Pumalanga, can hear us. And those outside of the two provinces, they have to stream live. Because we have people like from Cape Town listening to our show, people mm. from all over the world. So... At the same time that you guys are on, there's another show then running for the guys in Cape Town, bloody, bloody, bloody. From Joburg. From yeah. Joburg. Side. Yes, okay, yeah, because cool. everyone outside Cape Town, obviously, outside Joburg, stream mm. as well, but everyone within Joburg, Pumalanga, and everything else still can listen to all the shows. So, yeah. Okay. And then, what's next now? Because you are now Mrs. Limpopo. My year of rain is coming to an end in a couple of months. I'm sad, but I've had fun so far. But what do you do as Mrs. Charity, Limpopo? A lot of charity work, a lot mm. of community engagements, and just the nice chilling, place, just chilling, and just being a you know a brand ambassador for women. And for me, the reason that I entered Mrs. Limpopo is to show women that age is nothing but just a number. Even if you're married, you have yeah. children, you can still become what you want to be. I mean, like you, you're what sixty four. Ooh, so, <laughs> I you'd say 16. You carry your years <laughs> so well. No, but really, I'm you're 32. I'm turning 36 in a oh, couple 36. of months. Yeah. Okay. And um, I, I, so now, after Mrs. Limpopo, then do you have to, does it work like sport, right? You get low felt colors, far north, northern Transvaal, South African colors. Yeah. So, if you are now Mrs. Limpopo, do you by default then you already entered for Mrs. South Africa or must you enter for that as well? I need to enter for that as well, but I think I'm going to take a break now, for now. Um, the stilettos are getting a bit much. Not not really. I think I need to extend my family. I think I need to start, really? work, yeah, I need to start working on that now. Do you, wanna, you wanna want like to extend, extend, like, like Nathan and no, her little brother? I, or or baby sister, yeah. I think it's time now. Um, I think He'd be a really cool big brother though, eh? He would. Mm -hmm. definitely definitely be so yeah i think it's next year's business and planning on extending the family i think okay. let me give it a try and see what what goes in and then um i forgot to ask you just now which school did you attend mudubatsi high school in habani Pulobedu. yeah so then you and lucy are also probably friends right lucy from yes. Skolpik. she's mm -hmm. my friend yeah did she also go to the same school as you no she was in Merenski. really yeah I was in Marinsky. I go for Lucy or Kopi Shark. Yeah, this is amazing. I love her. I go for Lucy. And Lobedu. Yeah. Kilobedu. Yeah. Yeah. In Shangan, in Afrikaans, in Engels, in Zulu. I go for Manani and Lucy Gelaiki. That's all flipping cool, guys. Yeah. Do it. I'm going back up now. Who comes? Some of you are alien. Is it the feel? Yeah. Sweet, yeah. It's okay. It's your palms nut. Yeah. She's going to know how to cook. What's the music? Is your favorite music? Dude, music. Yeah. I guess we had a boy band, for sure. So, uh, Backstreet Boys. Westlife. Westlife. Any day. In sync. A bit. A bit. Justin eh. Trouser Snake. Uh, Justin, Timberlake. Yeah, oh, I love Justin Timberlake. I had a crush on him. Oh, yeah. So, do you have a stuff. current celebrity crush? Ah. He's amazing. I just just love him. He's okay. just yeah. Um, and there's nothing wrong with having celebrity yeah, crushes. No, all of us do. I have the biggest crush on him, but my husband knows. He's like, mm, I see you, but yeah. you're mine. <laughs> you're taken. <laughs> but yeah, no. But I just love his work and what he does, and I think he's very inspiring. And to be bold like that, to do the things that he does, mm. I think one can easily not attracted in that sense, but it's like a crush. And so, yeah. all right. When you get into your studio, Lana, mm -hmm. do you get you don't get to choose songs for the playlist. Barney does that. No, no, we have a music. Really? Producer. So you can actually. We just. I just. Can do. you send in suggestions? Well, they would then go through to Tabiso. Okay, who's yeah. the producer? Uh, our producer is Seppo. Okay. Yeah. And then, um, so okay. That's very interesting. I thought you. No, no, no. We have a, a say, producer. You could like play your own stuff. No, no. The only person who gets to choose his music is Barney on Sundays. Who is Barney's? Yeah, girl. I mean, like, yeah, he's but a high school legend. classic. Getting there. Getting there. I'm getting there. And did you guys study after school? I did, but I did distance study. So I've got qualifications in finance. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. And Which I work for insurance as well. Yeah, that makes sense now. Why you were selling overpriced. Oh, um, sorry, sorry. What was it called again? Those are premium brand cars premium. and they're not overpriced. They are 
quality it's the best of nothing you can never say that please i love mercedes benz and nobody can ever tell me something else about those cars i mean and, you know that. but isn't it like um mercedes bmw same thing you know look it's not the same okay even though they're all german cars mm. it is definitely not the same mercedes benz is more for your executive people for me mercedes benz speaks to me and i just love the brand so um what are some of the perks of being mrs limpopo do you get to drive one of those cars i do get sponsored by mercuria so if i've got oh. it yeah so if i do have events and things like that they sponsor me and yeah they just so do you do the whole like i've got a nice car driver no, I drive myself. Oh, I am not strong, independent. I'm Mrs. not Limpo. Tyler who says she's what girl from Jovic. She's got a chauffeur. I don't have those things. I have to drive myself <laughs> whenever that I need to go. I'm a girl from Limpopo, so I drive myself. Okay. Yeah. And um, if you, how long do you think um, you are going to do Manani radio presenter? For the longest time, I think. Yeah. Because but I, I mean, also wanted that you to want to do. Right? Yeah, yeah, I did. So actually the story behind me also getting to Jacka, I remember I was 16 years old when my father, to my father, my father, Jacka ran to get to Polokwani. And I was like, okay, is this something that maybe I could do? Because my dad said to me, you have to feel like you have to do it. And I did love talking because I'd always present things to them. And I would have never guessed. Who <laughs> would have guessed like 18, 19 years yeah, later, here I am auditioned and I got the job is I feel like sometimes you know God knows when the time is right to put you into places and to make you meet the people that you have to meet um so who would you really like to maybe interview over radio one day because I'm sure you will eventually get to the point where you'll be able to also host the show and even if a lot of the times, um, the guys start off in radio mm -hmm. to get a feel for it, like what you're doing now. And then they give them like a show 11 o'clock till 1 o'clock tonight. No? Mm -hmm. And then they give them the, like, but I know the morning and the afternoon shows are like the ones. But then they eventually move into like the 9 o'clock to 11 o'clock or 12 o'clock slot. No, you have your and, morning, yeah. your breakfast show or yeah. your drive show. And I can, I can actually see you doing something like that. But when you get to that point, who would you like to interview one day? Except for me, of course. Quest for you. <laughs> Joe. Who would you? Who would a musicant. Oh yeah, if you're a musicant, you can uh, actress, actor. Oprah. Oprah. Yeah, I really want to know how she did it because, I mean, one woman standing all these years, mm. health, everything else, and she's just built an empire. And carried on. And she's on. still going on. Mm. I mean, she was one of the first females, you know, from overseas to open a school in South Africa for girls. That for me says a lot. Um, all right. So if you could use, obviously there are lots of girls that look up to you, uh -huh. especially in the Bulubedu and the, where you come from, right? Because they know you. So um, what would you like to see change? And, and if you could help to change it, what would it, what would the biggest thing be? I know it's like a really difficult question, mm -hmm. but if you have maybe a top five and there's and you could choose one out of the top five, what thing would you most like to see change? Ooh, Joe, from a fussy. Um, Joe, I know I'm an advocate for, for women and, and young girls and all that, but it's like really a tough question. Do you think that maybe the reason why it's a tough question is because... There, there's no clear answer really because there's so much that can be changed and sometimes you look at something and it's a, to us it might be a small change but it brings about big changes so I, I, I digress it might be a bit of a difficult it is, it or is. a loaded <laughs> question but um, surely we can start somewhere um, so maybe I don't know maybe we should look at, at well you've started something with the, with our school girls with yeah, hygiene, wasn't it? yeah, I do sanitary towels yeah. that, that I donate to schools to young girls as well because I believe no girl should miss a period because of her period. It's, yeah. yeah, and then also, I mean, that's it seems insignificant to most of us, right? That it is, but so it makes a change yeah. in a lot of girls' lives. And I feel like in most of those communities, there's just no education on girls and, and no assistance. Yeah. You know, I've also got a daughter, as you know, and 
I now understand the impact that something so seemingly insignificant can have. Like a period. Yeah, on that child because yeah. they don't know. And yes. now what do you do? Because now you, now it's break time. Yeah. And and it's a mess. Yeah. Yeah. So um, I think that's a very oh. um, admirable thing to do. Yeah. Very honourable, and um, I hope that you carry on with that. I so am definitely. When when I first met you, were you um, Mrs. South Africa then? Finalist, semi -fi semi finalist. So I just want to get my facts straight, right? <laughs> because like you can't keep up with my nanny. So you were a semi finalist, and weren't you a finalist then later as well? No. no. Okay, but you are now going for it again this year. No, I'm taking a break. Yes, you said a break, yeah. For a year. Okay. At least. I think. But you, you were only once then. I went, well, I feel like... Like, time doesn't make sense since lockdown. What did you do in lockdown? We was by the house, but we had to work. We had to work every day for people to get out and try to get clients, so that today, whenever we just, they decide when it's lockdown, it's over. I had some customers to service and give cars and sell cars. I get annoyed, annoyed. It was every day meetings hard. So we kept working. Wasn't it even, I don't know, for me, it felt more tiring in lockdown. Because uh -huh. you're at home, but everybody can reach you. And, yeah. and they can have a meeting whenever they want to. Yeah, no, true. It, okay. it was a bit annoying, but I mean, business had to go on. I had to get paid by then, but yeah. It, so you would actually, it would actually, you would have benefited really nicely being a, um, a radio presenter. If I'd been a presenter then, yeah. Because yeah, I would have done the show from home as well, yeah. which is, you know. Um, do you think that... Um, that whole lockdown thing um, brought about, about change, like now in our community, where, where certain things have changed so drastically that it's going to take years for it to either go back to normal or just be accepted as how as things are. If and I, I hate the term new normal, by the way, so I try to... D try to yeah, but what I think for me, um, a lot of things that, you know, changed is how people do business. And mm -hmm. and I think every person who's got a business out there can really attest to this because literally in COVID, we all had to change. Everything had to be, you know, you have to online meetings. People still do them. Yes, they weren't that big, but people, you know, it was that. And I think it's still continuing today. But a lot of businesses, I've seen a lot of businesses close down. Yeah, that's, that's tragic. Lockdown, that's traumatic. And after lockdown and still now people, I think it's going to take, probably another six six years or so mm -hmm. to have businesses, you know, get back to where they have to be. And, and especially now with the country, with a new government of unity and everything else, I think it is, that's a topic for another day, but I feel like there's still a long way. And by all means, it's here, I be it, by I see it now for all my motor bedrijf work, that's moeilijk. Yeah, I see it as I deal with my client work. We did the grant and all this. And I see that the great ones, those great ones that can do in the air. Yeah. And it's not by us. Yes, it's all. 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 It's showrooms everything empty empty true sending empty and, the, and then it was like jaguar mm. uh, you know big brands yeah they were empty created by that mensio um stop and net media will prod right for all no the pajaka is in mrs limpau burn all our food for the work the company with the driver is small there's no mirror Mensen is toch, oh, is jy my naam nie? Kijk, ja, dis ek. Betek, jy is ook bang, want jy weet nie, hoekom wil jy weet, wat het ek nou gedoen? Ja. En ek weet bijvoorbeeld, my kinders, obviously my dochterkie, dan, sy sê, daddy, is dat dan nie my naam nie? Dan sê ek, na my baby, she's on radio when, just now, in the homeschool. En, toe tel ons een keer vir Nathan op, ou wel, tel vir ouwe op, en Nathan, hulle lust ons altijd so. Ja. Sy is by die venster uit, Nathan, jou mama is op die radio. Dat is so cute, ne? Nathan is like, hy kreis kam, ne? Ach, maar hy is een lieflike kind, hy het een goeie hart, een gouwe hart. So, jylle blij ons nie, nie, dit is heel vir ons gemeenskap. Rok het die, rok het die bykie van, 
is dus een mission om op een af te rijden. Nie. Ik voel betek keer is van, ha, en dan in die middag, is het, jy, ek gaan huis toe. <laughs> but, maar, yeah. maar dit is ook exciting, denk ek, want um, you're doing something you love, and yes. then that's it old saying, right? Yeah. You never work a day in your life. Yes, ja. Yeah. Ek so, voel nie vir my, dat so het werk is nie, jy is in die oog, en dat betek is, kan iemand weet hier rijden, asjeblief, voel ek al nie te vat nie, en verstaan, as al vliegtuig hier was, of een helikopter, gereid, gevlieg tot die mol of die not op die dak, en afgeklim, jy weet, soos James Bond, daar uitgekom. <laughs> en, um, die jy en dochterkie was, wat vir jy gewees het, jy en lach? Dit wat ek nou doen. Prachtig. En op die FV gewees het, ek wil altyd op 7 laan gewees het. Ek dink sy so cool ingepas het in 7 laan in, he? Sy so flippin cool ingepas het. Ja. Ek het nogal my nanny daar so sien. My nanny. <laughs> is die 7 laan is klaar? Dit is klaar, dit is voorbij. Sien, ah. Uh, dat is ander goed, en sal maar sien. Maar hoekom, just go for it, man. I mean, you yeah. always just go for it. Since I've known you. Ja, yeah, no. Like, ek is nie bang vir niks nie. Welke kar nou reg my nanny, ek sal het self, ek sal het doen, ek sal het probeer. Ek sal het reg te kry, ja. Fijn, a friend. I am that girl, man. Let me go get a... Ja. Yeah. <laughs> Kom lach jy. Behalve nou vir jou... Dat is jou favorite spun maat. Wat sy ander celebrities was, <laughs> was al celebrity met die hele moed het, wat jy is like, jy is my hierdie ou, of hierdie vrou, is eindelijk so cool. En jy, het, jy ken hulle al van radio af, van TV of whatever, en jy het gedink eindelijk, it's like, I really don't want to approach them, because maybe I don't know how they, en toe is hulle super cool. Nadine. Ja, dat is aan reis. Ja, Nadine, ek het al vir jou niet, ok, ek het letterlijk in die bos, ja, ja. dat ek allemaal ontmoet, uh, Dozy, het ek ontmoet toe ek 10 jaar oud was, hy het die kom op die inzien en ek was so klein gewees en ek het sy muziek geloof, ek het Dozy sy muziek geloof en toe ek hom ontmoet was as van wow en um, ek het al vir oom Kurt, Kurt Zerren ontmoet ook, vir Katijn, Katijn, Spanje Seil, ek het hom ontmoet, ek het vir Bren Piper ontmoet, ek het al vir Bobby van Jaarsveld ontmoet, ek het al vir Uli B ontmoet, en oh, Uli B is awesome, like, awesome. hy is so cool, like, ja, hy is rarig amazing, vir wie het ek nog ontmoet, so sure, dit is en vir Lloyd Kelle ontmoet, ek het vir Louise Balla ontmoet, ek het letterlijk meeste van die mense uit Afrika ontmoet, so, en Rai Wat, laas jaar, op die nipperkie, op die nipperkie, ek was in Joburg gewees, ek en Sasha, ons is van, ook ook, hoe is life is nie door, daar is die tickets nie, iemand in, reel as op die vir my kaar, kies, toe krijg ek twee tickets, toe gaan kyk, hoe is life, <laughs> Like, letterlijk op die nipperkie, die vrijdagmiddag. En so, hy was amazing gewees. Het jou achtergekom, jy is eindelijk ook nou een celebrity. I don't... Because, let, let me burst your bubble here, because you are now, okay? So, um, jy gaan definitief op hierdie meer met jy. Daar. Sien, daar? Daar is al die mense, wat daar teken. Okay. Um, want, dit is net celebrities, wat die so mag sit en, en praat. Okay. Ja, so, jy is, so, jy is ook een celebrity. Nee, ek praat met celebrities. Ek is een drummer. Nou, hulle, is, hulle, hulle sê moos, drummers are people who hang around musicians. So, um, Joe mm-hmm. is a person who hangs around celebrities. You've got that thing. Yeah. That thing. That yeah. thing, thing. Yeah. Okay. Ask Uncle Barney, he'll tell you. Ja, nee, het my baie stories vertel van jou. The feel stories van jou vertel. Uncle Barney. Ja, your favorite. Mm, I love him. So, um, denk jy, jy so, um, in jou toekomst, dalk na a uh, ander radio, a talk show host, so 702, wat the talk show radio station is, en dit is nou niks om jou nie moeilijk uit te kry, of whatever nie, maar, <laughs> ek meen, jy kan sekerlik nog steeds, um, ek ken baie, um, jylle, jylle, jylle industrie, jylle oh. industrie werk soos die um, media, well, die printed media industry ook, um, amal is eindelik maaikies met mekaar, yeah, en, no, en like. skyf jy van, Hier al is daar so een rein toe, terug hier so soon toe, daar so, die job hier so, daar so, allemaal is job, en ons het saamgewerk op die show, ja, ja. en so, en so, en so. Ek denk, um, dit is ietsie dalk wat, um, en dit is my opinie, ja, Karanga kan dalk doen met die talkshow. Soos net a, an hour long talkshow, soos met die... Ja. Al het my post, uh, podcast ook. Ja, ja. so, hoe kom nie die podcast nie? Ja. Waar gaan ek verdeel, en maar doen my podcast, because ja. you've got a very good voice, En jy ken baie mense. Ja, nee, ja, dit is in die pipeline. Ja, dit is een ja, flippend cool ja, is. Ja. Om jou te antwoord, hmm. ek dink vir my op hierdie oomlik is het van, Jack has always been a dream. 
and I really want to live that dream. And I think we do want to sky free. I can talk shows, sky free. Yeah, but sure. in the family, the Jack family. But in the family, yeah. One day an opportunity comes. Manani, don't you want to join the breakfast team or don't you want to join the drive team or don't you want to drive join mm. this? I would definitely. But yeah. I love it when someone Bonnie and Sasha to work. And obviously, it's just like it's it's not barbecue steps. So mm. for now, let me. Do but this and enjoy it, and then you. Yeah. I have a question that I've always wanted to ask you. Oh, I feel I'm a brand new paper. The question is uh-huh. because I run into you a lot when I'm in Mall of the North, and you're sitting in your little glass kasi, also, na. Right? Why do you say it's little? Because it's a glass kasi. Okay. Na right? and yes, sir, Don, you. And I guess Klein. Yeah, he's by Klein, man. Okay. Yeah. So uh, now sit my nanny also in a glass kasi, na. What is the strangest thing that you've seen while sitting in your glass kasi? Because I am pretty sure that there must be some weird stuff, man. Because people don't pay attention that no. you are sitting there. No, they don't. And Le- you're watching, yeah, right? Yeah. Because people will pass around, hi, my nanny, and you carry on. And people forget. Mm-hmm. So come on, tell us some weird so, stuff. So, as you can start this, yes. I'm a box lock, right? Yeah. I think I need to do it for me, so go on me, so I get three papa, so I think I need to go to town, so I'm going to try to see my mate, so I'm going to go to the town, 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 so I'm going to go to Maar ek, ek krijg baie liefde van die mense af daar so, nou dat hulle weet as iemand daar so, mm. maar mense loop daar net mooi voorbij en maak hulle vir my so. So dis lekker. En ek denk het is super cool om attached te wees aan a brand soos Jack Aranda, because Definitely. it's massive. Yes, it is. So people kind of, I know when you walk in there, it might be a small little place. Mm-hmm. No, I'm just joking with you. No, I know, I know. Yeah. My studio is, it's awesome. I yeah. love it. Well, it's bigger it's than... Het is te veel goed, ek moet yeah, and it's bigger than Barney Manani, but it's Genevieve Afghanistan. It's bigger than mine, uh, but I have the advantage of a Tessa over there. Say Drek Ali Knopis and say Din Ali Gukis Da. Mute, mute, Tessa, mute. <laughs> <laughs> so um, it's, it's refreshing when you walk in there and you go and you see the purple, and then you know it's Jacaranda, and then you know, ah, it's Polokwane, it's Jacaranda, that must be Manani. Yeah. And you know what? My favorite color is. Wait, wait, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Purple. Yeah. My engagement psychic. ring was purple. I'm psychic. Yeah. Okay. I love purple. Like a spash. So, have you ever been late for your show? Once. And then no, 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 no. Not for the show, no. But what? I've been late to, clock, to be at work like at 11. But I did tell Barney, like, dude, I'm going to be late. He's like, no, we worry me. Uh-huh. I'll see a lot of this and yes, join. I'm like, but I'm not going to be late. I'll be there on time. But it was 30 minutes and I don't, I'm not late. So I always drive early to be early at work. So I'm always there 10 o'clock or so, before that. I just want to get this straight, right? Mm. So, Manani. Mm. <laughs> it's like, I kijk in your ear, I can see what the question is. So, Manani, work from 11 uur in the morning. Yes, but vier uur. Manani begin werk, elf uur in die, eleven o'clock, guys. Ja, yeah. elf tot vier. Until four o'clock. Mm. It's terrible. Why? Slave, man. You're, It's you're not. You're a slave to This the is, system. Dude, I used to work seven <laughs> to seven, sun, Monday to Sunday. I have luxury now. Ek sit hier saam met jou vandag. Mm. Die nice ding is, die twee dag dat ek hier werk nie, ek spandeer tijd saam met my kind. Mm. En, um, well, I get you all seen. Um, we actually say MC, but we've been judges together. Yes. Okay, which was, yes, I think we're going to be a bit naughty on the kant. Who come? Who come? Who come? I think we're going to check those in the middle of the day. I think we're going to judge you. Yeah, yeah. What's the point of view? Meneer and my Fosie. Yeah, but I think we're going to be a bit naughty. Yeah, and who comes here? I naughty. So I know I'm naughty. Like, I know I'm naughty. Barney said it all in, but for me, I know you're stout, my nanny. I just want to have a little grievous man in me, but I'm a nice person. I think, I can see you by many people. Do you want to see MC? Yes. Is there something that people can do? If you want to see it now and you want to see it for my nanny, so that we're going to... 
تكون تاك بسون اللي غير هكذا نجي تخيل باش نقول لك اه كما ما سوشيال ميديا سوشيال ميديا ان بوكس هكا تو في اخر هكا دري باش نقول لك لايك اف كو ثري بيرسوناليتيز كو ماكس على تو اسم ناني مناني مناني بايتا سو سن ويت مين سن اولس اكسما لاود اي ام لاود بيرسون از ذا ريم بتنا يوسف ست يا اوكي سي ستاوت خات اوكي يا ذا سي اوكي يعني ريسي ستاوت خات ان انا تو مناني وبي في راديو She remain proper. She's professional, ma. She's not yet stout, ma. Professional stout. Now that we're only up as up as stage with the mic, was an MC for corporate means, a government means, a whatever people have MC that events we have introduced. Like that's where I met for the very first time. I had to introduce him because I was MCing at a big event. Um, that was like a huge one, and people have always told me because I know once I'm on stage or have a mic, personality wise, it's like. Boom! This girl just takes over now. I can also feel me, you know. Yeah. But it makes sense because my first impressions of you, because you were wearing like that v- super corporate outfit there, yes, in black and white. Yeah. So you can do that. I the, can. You can do I the can, complete corporate thing. Oh, I can so do I think, the blackies, scored brook. Yeah. Niara, calmly, no makeup, and I'm just still me. Okay. So I'm going to put your, we will put her details there for people who want to book her for events. Oh, thank you. Is that, yeah, yeah, great. Weddings, whatever it is. We do quite parties. a few weddings as well. Oh, really? So then, yeah. Okay. Can you sing? Oh, we'll, hello, we're going to Yeah, can you sing? Instruments? No. Okay. So Cooking. Cooking. And baking. But then why don't you do a podcast, Ma- uh, Manani's Come Kitchen? Come cook with me. Yeah. Oh. Manani's Kitchen. No problem. Can do that. What's your favorite food to make? Lasagna. Think about to make. To make myself. Mm. Lasagna. Really? Yes. Myself. Okay, from scratch. Can we order from you? No problem. When? For tomorrow. Okay. Cool. I, I, I like I'm cooking. I'm working tomorrow. Oh. You're from 11 till 4. Yeah, no. And then I have to drive back. Don't forget that I drive as well. So that's working because I'm driving to work. It's an hour's mm. drive to Polokwadi. So think. Think about that. Like, like most of us, we have to drive. So that's okay. I work. But says Iris. Do you read? Huh. You know what happens to me when I read? I, I, I feel like sometimes, I feel like I'm a terrible person. I'm going to be honest with you. I could be in a conversation with people. It's like I could already tell what they're going to say. I switch off. And then only later, I'm like, yeah, no, I get you. But I've heard everything they say. And I, that's why I do not read books because i can already tell i watch movies i love i love visual things okay. reading is not my strongest um suit know. yeah i think i'm more of a visual person because so, I, I already know what, how the book is gonna end i just reading the first pages I'm like, uh, i read books halfway and i'm like nah put this away i can't do this let me watch a movie rather so your um husband is also from here <clears throat> he's from polokwani Ah, do you see so you guys met there, yeah. not here? No, we met there. He's been chasing me for a year, and I have been rejecting him for a year, and then eventually, yeah, you know, eventually I said, okay, dude, what's it okay? Well, know? well, you know. And he said, no, let's. Can I invite him to my church? Because when we meet, he's like, no, I want to take you out for coffee, and I'm like, dude, I can make my own coffee. What about dinner? I'm like, I can cook. He's like, okay, what about a movie? I've got a TV at home. He's like, can I invite you to church? I'm like, good, let's go. And that's just, you know, it's been, it's been an amazing seven years, all the ups and downs we've had, but like know, every single, single really, Yeah, true. So, but I was luckily, it's just been us getting to know each other. And he doesn't talk much. Eh? No, he doesn't. But, um, he recently went to a men's conference and when I fetched him on Sunday, <laughs> oh, oh, I was like, Oh, Oh, wait. I don't know you like this. Please, can you stop for a minute? It's like, sorry. And I'm like, continue, but that buddy was looking really weird. I'm like, okay, what happened to you? It's like, no, I had fun. I'm like, this is what I've been wanting you to yeah. do for how many years now you're doing it. But but now you're starting to open up. But I think it's also, that's why you guys compliment each other. Because yeah. you are similar enough, but yes. also you've got enough differences yeah. to compliment each other. No, true. So that's yeah. fantastic. Yeah. I I think that we've had a really great discussion. Yeah. And you and I have also been friends for a while, even yes. though we do bite each other. A no, bit it's cool. I get you. <laughs> I get you. And we are due for a studio shoot one of these yes, days. Yes, I can't wait. When Let me lose for? weight first, please. You have lost weight. Not that much. No, but, but now you've lost a lot, but, eh? Yeah. 
No, a lot, man. I mean, like seriously, a lot. Even your husband's lost weight. Yeah. We're just trying to get everybody known the yeah. routine. We are all on a diet. But don't do anything about to Nathan's weight because Nathan's cute, okay? <laughs> I know. He's really glad to be. And but... he likes to sing also. Oh, yeah, he does. He's an amazing singer. And I think that's, that's something for him. Of course. Yeah. Music um, is very powerful, especially yes. with our kids. Yeah. So um, you should encourage that. But don't change him because he's really cool. I like the fact that he's like a gummy bear, right? <laughs> You should see him doing that, um, what's it, dance? With say Margot, this is a Margot thing. He's amazing at it. Yeah. But yeah, no, he's... he's and he's like, always smiling. Yeah, no. Leave like a good. He's just a mani, ma. but they get a big day. Yeah. Okay, so we will listen out for our very own manani, Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays. Yes. Jacaranda FM. Uh-huh. From 1. 12. 12 to four. To four. It's yes. three hours. Four. Four hours. Oh, it's nice. You and our vehicles. It's fine. So you just want to make sure. Mm-hmm. Like I sometimes send you stuff like on WhatsApp. Mm-hmm. Do I speak about it? Yeah. I do. You do. But yes. we don't want people to uh, like bombard you with it because you're busy, right? But if there's like breaking news. Please do. Um, you're obviously on most of the groups also with if there's a tree that fell over on Mahuba's cliff, or the fire or whatever. Then you find Joe and ask him, I'm on my way home, is anything happening? Is it safe for me to drive? <laughs> like, that was scary because I'm not used to us having protests in this no, area. there's another one on the 25th, eh? Of? They're at, at Sapika, yeah. I'm not working. I'm home. Yeah, good. 25 is what? Yeah, I think it's now. Thursday. Oh, cool. No, it's pretty ice. Yeah. I got so, chilled. Yeah, I don't know what exactly is going on there, but I've got yeah, the there's a lot of things that's going on. I'll send you the place. poster, and also, you know, it's I'll same. talk about it tomorrow, though. To yeah, so yeah, but not um, speculative stuff. I, I try and steer away. People obviously always go and like, why aren't you reporting on this? And you've not said it. Where I'm like, listen, guys, you don't understand mm. how it works. Mm. Whatever I put out there is there forever. If my True. facts are not yeah correct, exactly, it's a, it's not going to yeah. go down well. Mm. So um, if you guys do have any news for Manani, breaking news, don't bombard her, then just send it to her. I, no, I've send actually heard it. studio WhatsApp. Yeah. Yeah. And it's difficult, to, no, but it's not really, eh? if you oh. send a voice note, you, you yeah. do listen to it because you just mute your mic or Barney mutes you or whoever. Yeah, no, no, I mute. Yeah. No. Okay, cool. And when you guys are in Mall of the North, go and stop by and say Pana hi. Panakuka sublief uh, and cook and build them. Panakuka cook and build them. Yeah. My yes, he built them. Also, we built them. Uncle kid on our way. It's by like I'm a flap and dear. I can nog geen eten. Ga je van mij koffie zitten ook Ja. Oké, cool. Kijk, okay, maar ik zal via Bolton van die afkoring zijn. Uh, die beste Bolton. Hmm. En dan papa. Is Is vlees lapa is Bolton. Vlees lapa. En Polokwani. Die beste Bolton. Uh. Maar ja, en Wally, my oom, ze Bolton was ook wel lekker. Oké, okay, maar jullie, daar is baie ooms wat nou, of van jullie wat paas Bolton meesters is. Ek denk ons moet de challenge daar uitzet. Cool, kom ons doen een Bolton uh, challenge in zin in. Ja. Yeah. Wie sê jy is dit? Vleis wie? Vleis Lapa en Polokwane. Is jy dan net gewoon Vleis Lapa, ne? So my nanny en ek gaan judges wees. Dan. Ok, cool. Ne? Dan mm. bring vir ons die samples. A Biltong Fees. Ja, en dan livestream ons dit. Biltong Fees. Ek denk ons is onto something hier, so ons moet dit doen. Tra- ja, like... Biltong Fees, ne? Mm. Bring jy die beste drewoos, kabanossie, Biltong, geelvet Biltong. En wijn. En wijn. Ja. Yeah. Ok. Mm-hmm. And then, so I can say, he's going sit in on Soviet live. Mm. Blind test. Blind cool. test. Now, net, net this, I mag weet, wiesen is wiesen. Cool. So, is that your name at you? Mm. What do you get this off? And I'm doing it live. This all that. And I'm kissing his wiesen, it's like a stuff. Okay, cool. And it's price of eight work, we mean, so whatever. Yeah. Mm. So, I think it's a deal. Come on, soon. It's a dog for Barney, okay? Is Uncle Barney is the fair. I know. Vlieg om hier naartoe. Vraag vir Steven om om te gaan haal. Weet jy hoe graag wil hy op die bulletin sy voorblad wees? Die baan nie. Ja. Nou kom, doen jy dit nie. Want hy is te ver. Jy kan my so toe rui. Vlieg om hier naartoe. Nee, ons maak een plan. Hy sal die herkom klimp ook wat toe. Dankie my na nie dat jy saam met ons kom. So groot plesier. Ons gaan weer gesels. En ons gaan die bulletin ding doen, he? Yes, definitief. Ok. Ek gaan dit in die kwant ook sit hierdie week. Ok. Bie van die challenge. Ja. Bulletin. Kabarossie en drivers. Ek doen. En wat sy bulletin eet jy nie? Ek het alles. Okay. Koedie ook, is my ginstelling. Koedie bultong. Uh, hmm. En koedie woos. En, en het jy al ooit um, hoener bultong geet? Uh. 
en bacon, uh, daai vark bultong, bacon mm. bultong, dis flippen lekker na. En hy klein steeks wat hulle verkoop by Marana. Ah, en jylle pakkie nou, het wees Shout out to Marana ook. Ja, hulle mm. bultong is, haar man, jylle bultong is uitstekende bacon. It's amazing, I love it, ja. En jylle het ook baie, baie lekker wijn, hy het vir my die nawekke bottle melou gegeen. Mm-hmm. Baie, baie lekker. Het jy alleen gedrink? Ek drink nooit alleen. Oké. Okay. Hmm. Die gedeel. Ja. Mm, sharing is caring, jy weet het moes. Okay. And catches with matches. Mm, ciao Gina. <laughs> Bye, my honey. Bye.